Okay, so I wasn't sure if I was ever actually going to do this, but I decided, yay, I'm going to vlog about my life in general. I'm holy jeez, it's 1.10, I'm supposed to be out of here at 2, but I'm waiting for my silly boyfriend who insists on taking a really long shower. Anyway, I just went in there to say hi to him, and he pops his head out of the shower, and what do I see? His entire mustache is gone. It's just, it, it's gone. Usually, my CJ has a mustache. Yes, his name is CJ. And it's gone now. So. That just made me start thinking about how you guys don't really know a lot about me. And if I want to have some long time subscribers, which would be wonderful, then, yeah, if you're looking for a makeup tutorial, exit the video right now, because this is just going to be a long, boring rant about my life. <laughs> so. <sighs> things about me. Things about me. I, I, I think, yeah, about a year and a half ago, I had never really dyed my hair before. I mean, I'd done bright red a bunch of times. I had pink hair once when I was really young, but nothing too bold. And my hair was parted straight in the middle, and it was this big, huge, fluffy, curly brunette, and it came down to about there. And that, that was just bad. Bad, bad, bad. And I always wanted to do like a more bold hairstyle, so I cut my hair, still center part, straight down to there, everywhere else, all the way around to about my ears. And I had lot these long ass pieces in the front, and I dyed it all bright red. It looked okay, not so great. Picture. Okay, now that I've added the picture, I assume, since I'm going to edit this later, but then after that I went black, and that's when I met my boyfriend. And that sounded horrible. No, I dyed my hair black, and, and then I met my boyfriend. And he is the most adorable thing, but when we first met, we were just, we were great for each other, but, you know, it's like, we were in one of those relationships where it's going to last like three months and you know it, and you just make better friends. And then he moved away. Cry, cry, cry. And I did cry. Cry, cry, cry. But I had a wonderful summer. I partied really hard. I just enjoyed being a teenager, basically. Um, then once school clicked back in in the fall, I went into online school. I basically don't know where I'm going with this, but in the summer, I had bright pink hair! Super bright pink hair, which was to about there, because it had grown, and I chopped off the front pieces. And pictures of my black and my pink hair. Right there. Okay, um, then after that I did something horrible that I should never have done. I tried to get my hair as bleached as possible out away, uh, away from the pink, and then I wanted to do pink bangs and blue everywhere else. Now, the problem with this super light blue dye, it doesn't like to stick to anything except for ultra bleached hair. So it was light blue at the roots, and then it was kind of a faded greeny yellow everywhere else. It wasn't pretty. It was not. So, everything ended up working out kind of okay, though. I mean, I, I, I ended up dyeing my hair... What's it called? Alpine green. Punky color alpine green. Picture. That doesn't like to bleach out. I'm warning you now. Beautiful color on me. I freaking loved it, but I don't like having the same color for a long time. And that is the kind of color, like black and dark blue, you gotta have it for a while. Because it does not want to bleach out. So I tried to bleach it out really hard, you can see here. Nope, 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 nope. And that is around the time that I got back with my boyfriend. Yes, he was having a bad home situation where he moved, and he was moving with an with a friend. So I was like, move in with me. And my mom's like, sure, let him move in with us. And my brother's like, well, my girlfriend already lives here, so I can't say either way. And then he moved in, 
and it was it's wonderful my mom basically like adopted him she loves him to death and she is so awesome that she even got us her own bed i know right you can see our nicknames for each other up there i'm kitten <laughs> and then after more towards um december i decided to completely revamp my hair and i bought two bottles of bleach and one bottle of black and i was like i am done with randomly dying strips of pink in my hair with what tiny little bit of flamingo pink I had left. And I was going to meet my boyfriend's family. So, I dyed it black with blonde on top, and one second, you guys. Now, shit, I'm going back to my video. Well, I'm gonna be walking past... Well, actually, maybe. Well, the chair is right there, so it's not like your face is gonna get shown. Your face. So, <laughs> sorry. That is him right behind me. That is my CJ. You can't really see him, and he's camera shy, but... Like I was saying, when I went to go meet his family, I was like, I'm sick of this stupid green hair, and stop whispering stuff, and... Talk to myself! I dyed it all black underneath, with blonde on top, and then I got really bored of that after a while, so I did bright rose red on top, and I just kept the black on the bottom. Two pictures of what that looks like now. And then I went for this. This, this is, that is my entire history of dyeing my hair. So. I used to have my hair bright red. He used to have his hair bright red. Which does not suit a native that well. He's native! Sorry, I'm sexually attracted to native guys. Though, it did look good on my mom. His mom's really beautiful. With red hair. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Oh, shit. You, oh yeah, you're filming. Fuck, sorry. <laughs> I need to censor him. Yeah. So, it has been... Well, I told you guys, he moved in with me. That was around my birthday in early October. And seven months ago, almost eight. And our six-month anniversary was in April. And he got me this. I completely won. That was awesome. I won. When I came home, I came into the bedroom after waiting for like a half an hour. And I apologize, viewers. This went from makeup and hair to her gushing over me. I apologize. <laughs> and he made me dinner, well, lunch, and picnic. Then it was a picnic on our bed, and then he's like hit the space bar, and I did, and he was playing. Well, I guess it's not our song, but, but it's, it's our song, really. Yeah, it's our song, and it's it's it's. <laughs> Fuck, I don't remember the name of our song. <laughs> I'm a bad girlfriend. Um, you just have a bad memory, fucking stupid. Not online, honey. Not online. <laughs> yeah, so... You just censor, like, every other word of mine. <laughs> you put my voice through, like, a synthesizer? A, synthesi a, a synthesizer. Things? There you go, I have a list. Yeah, so... <laughs> anyway. Yeah, so then I hit it, and it was... Jake plus Olive. There you go. By. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, it was Jake plus Olive by. Mac Lethal. Mac Lethal. Oh, but you got it. <laughs> and it was really romantic, but that was CJ distracting me. So, this is. I told you guys, I warned you, this is just me talking about me in general. And I'm a big goofus. So. Yeah. I'm about to go to the mall. So, this is. I don't know, I ran out of things to say. So, I'm about to go to the mall and meet up with a friend of mine. Well, yeah, a friend of mine. And I'm meeting up with another friend of mine to get me a pack of smokes. Because I will admit to you guys, I'm a smoker. I I will say it, I'm a smoker. I, I really, really need a pack of smokes right now. Because I have got like four projects due at school. And I'm so stressed. And I've got a whole weekend of studying ahead of me. And I've got my exams coming up soon for English 10, because I will finally be passing it and get it out of my life once and for all, because I had to pass English 9 in summer school last year, back when I was being a failing kid. Mm. Fun fact about me, I used to be dating a guy and it didn't go so well, but my life was just very hectic at the time, so I dropped out of school. But I used to go to the high school, like, right down my street, and I'm not telling you guys where that is, so... Um, then I dropped out, and I was like, I just, I didn't go to school from, I think, April till September. And September I started in online school, 
don't go to online school if you have no self-control. It was not worth it. I completely failed. But now that I'm in an alternative high school, A student, oh yeah, high five, fist bump, bro. But... I've lost faith in television. Why? The Real Housewives. They recently, my boyfriend just said that he has lost faith in television because they recently came out with a show around my home city, Vancouver. Oh no, it's just any Real Housewives. The Real Housewives series. I, I can't stand that. That's not what we're like in Vancouver. If you want to see the Real Housewives of Vancouver, go to like Hastings and Maine, okay? Follow some crackheads. <sighs> I'm going to Penticton to do the same. But um, boom, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna send this link to your mom. Oh, you're gonna get me so killed. <laughs> I can't make idle jokes. The second time he's made fun of his mom in this video. I make fun of my mom all the time because she makes fun of me. It's okay, I make fun of her too. She's a Drugs, lady. there. Now you have to censor the whole thing. You're gonna have to re-record this, aren't you? No, I'm totally uploading all of this. Oh, uh, no you are not. Okay, so. I will flag her to that because you showed Peter. Not that part. I'm cutting out this part. You're putting out. <laughs> okay, so sorry. I just had to cut out part of the video because my boyfriend's really inappropriate. But penis. Anyways, you guys, I love you and have an awesome day. <laughs> and remember to please the dolphins if you like and subscribe. Bye.